Well, the issue is just, uh, you know, it's an in-house misunderstanding between the WIDI members and the executives. And uh, the essence of our meeting here is to, you know, come together for a mutual understanding, considering we identify the loopholes of where the issue is. Now we have worked towards making the solution, finding a lasting solution for the progress of the association. The essence of our coming together is for we to be identified by the government agencies uh, so that we shall now forward our uh, you know, request to the government towards our granite production. We are farmers, we are granite producers, but we've not been getting what other commodities have been getting as far as uh, relatively to, uh, you know, uh, Uncle Boros program, I can say, and other different activities. Despite the fact that we are getting a little from the raw material and uh, raw material research institute and the Federal Ministry of Agriculture. So, uh, but at least we want to move higher. We want to move higher. We are talking about the value chain, production, processing, and the marketing. And to you know, go through the value chain entirely, you have to have a, you know, even if not abundant resources, but at least a little resources in your you know, so that you can move forward. The government have been intervening in our issue now. Uh, they have been intervening. Both the two ministries that we are intervening in our issue, and now we have come together as one family. So it is now that we are coming together as one family. Before, if you are in a crisis and every, you cannot go to government for any assistance, but now we are coming to uh, as a one family. So we have come, we have resolved our issue. So we are going to the government for assistance. The problem we are facing now is all over because you have a crisis between two groups. But as of yesterday, we came here, um, make a meeting, all of us, we agreed to come under one umbrella. And now we don't have any crisis again. We are one umbrella, even after the meeting, we have formed a committee with nine persons um, pertaining for showing the Anko Baroa program, which all we agree for that. Um, and also today we came here and to meet with our president to uh, just to show him our surrender all. We agreed to come and be one hungry man. So far for the farmers we have the program by our father that is President Muhammad Buhari called Anko Boroa. And also, uh, uh, two years ago, we, ha we could not get that Ankoboroa program because of our crisis. But now, as we have come and made our association to be one, so our needs from the federal government, police, and CBN, uh, we will join that Ankoboroa. We are in already, and we are looking for that assistance to our members for that Ankoboroa. That's our need. We are here on a peaceful meeting between the agro men where there is a misunderstanding in between the members. This is why we are two or three days here to resolve the issues. And God in his mercy we are able to resolve the issues peacefully and amicably. There was not, no problem as such. There was a slight misunderstanding which now uh, uh, a disagreement over an issue which uh, we, we come to sit down, it wouldn't give us the best. Now we had to come and sit down and resolve the issue amicably. And so we did. We, did, we called from the other, this side and from the other side to see that we resolve this issue and the grace of God, we are able to resolve it peacefully without any problem. We, we applied already, we have applied for a loan at the central bank. Uncle Brower, they, they ask us to submit names 
and our demands, which we did, are getting to two years now. And we are still on the move that the federal government should assist the groundnut sector or the agro man in getting a loan for the farmers to boost their farming profession. So we are still appeal appealing to the government to see that he release this loan to the farmers. We have all put up all necessary uh, uh, requirement from the uh, central bank. We have sat down with the central bank officials and they did agree that we will get the loan from them. And this is why we are here to see that an Uncle Barrow ad hoc, ad, ad hoc committee was inaugurated this morning to go ahead with the program. So we pray that the federal government and the leadership of Muhammad Buhari to see to the masses problem and release the loan for them. It will be good for Nigerians to see that we get another way rather than the oil something. Oil was being made out of groundnuts and it is the groundnuts, the cotton, the cocoa that made Nigeria to be what it is today. But now we are forgetting about the, these crops. So we better go back so that we get a way of getting revenue. Revenue. 